he's now making fun of my disability, this piece of shit. See that? I would appreciate it if you'd leave me the fuck alone now. How about no? You wanna play some games? Yeah. They pick on you on the street? You wanna play some games? Yeah. Yeah, let's go. Let's go around the back and uh, talk uh, shop. What's that mean? I save your life. Snap. Please snap. Hurry up. Snap. Every day, 20 years, and this dumb piece of state thinks he can break me. I would never break you. Yeah. You're a good guy. We went to school together. Mm, here we go again. You don't want to go to school with me? There it is. The swallow of fear. That's all I needed. That's all I needed. Yeah. Have we, have we met before? Yeah, we did this before, remember? You were like, forgot who I was. Y'all look like me, dude. Well, Wait, you wear that badge, it means you cooperate with my daughter's rapists, and I just pretend you're not even oh, there. The FBI, they raped my daughter for the well, same reason you're that, fucking with me. Same reason you're fucking with me. Same reason you're fucking with me. Same reason you're fucking with me. No, you just, yeah, do their no. Bit, you just do their bidding. Obviously, you're not FBI. No. You're, I just you're, do barely even, you're barely even a security guy. Barely, I know. I just make money. How do you like that? Are we done? Are we done? Yeah. Are we done? Yeah, I'll follow okay. you. Come on, let's go. We're gonna have fun. Come on. We're gonna go shopping together. Yeah, it's okay because it's private property. I can do that. Come on, I'm gonna show you how I work. Come on, I'm gonna show you how I work. I'm gonna show you how I work. Or you can turn around and go. I can turn around and go? Yeah. Yeah, but I'm shopping here. Yeah, I want to shop with you. Come on. Do you? Yeah. We're going to shop together. That's nice. Dollar Tree wants your dollar. Oh yeah? Yeah. You gotta put it in the parking lot. Do I? Yeah. Okay. The parking spot. Alright, see you later. Huh? It's gone. It's gone? Yeah. Uh-oh, -uh, no way, bro. Yeah, I'd, I'd move it. I, would you move it? Yeah. Okay. Or what? Well, I'm gonna take it. You're gonna take it? Yeah. You're gonna take it? It's got my stuff I in it though. I can see your phone right there and it's not working. Yeah. Do you need me to charge it for you? You want to play some games? Yeah. Yeah, let's go. Let's go around the back and uh, talk uh, shop. What's that mean? What does that mean? Yeah. We got, I got some coffee around the back. Coffee? Yeah, we can have some coffee and a cigarette. Why don't you go do that? Come on, let's go. Okay. I got, hey, I got dentures too. Oh, careful. Did you just hit me? I don't know, man. Did I? Did you just get my way? Could be in, could be in trouble. Uh-oh. You were making me move my cart, and then you stood in the way of its obvious turn radius, though. So, how's that? There you go. Perfect. Yeah? Why are you wearing a Boston hat? Excuse me? Why do you have a Boston hat on? It's not a Boston hat. Yes, it is. It's, I want to be president. It's, see how that works? Okay. Anyway.
Oh God, he's so hard to outsmart. <laughs> we done yet or no? Yeah, I'm way done. Come on. Right. Whatever you got, it's cool. Why don't you suck a wet fart out of my ass, you boot-licking piece of shit? <laughs> you remember you started talking shit first. Do you remember that? It's not recording. It's ridiculous. Come on. You sure you're not a fed, bro? Because that's some really good gaslighting. Yes. Because that's some really good gaslighting. Yes. Yes. I don't know what that meant, but that's cool. You don't know what gaslighting means? I don't know what you mean. Oh, okay. Not very bright, are you? No. I mean, you got to be pretty fucking stupid to not even be a real cop. I know. Right? right? You know how dumb they are? You know how stupid you have to be to be a cop? Is that... Good, what? good, I mean, good comeback, G. You ever heard that song? Please stop harassing me. Please stop harassing me. I will. You will? Yeah. When? As soon as you stop talking shit. Stop talking shit and like a punk. Treating you like a punk. Oh, you poor thing. Are you okay? Get a homeless guy make fun of your nigger ass. I'm going to leave this right here because this man's harassing me, so... This is me just trying to buy laundry soap today. Can you fucking believe this? Laundry soap, where? Where is the laundry soap? Oh my fucking God. I do the same thing, I have dentures too. Shut the fuck up. Where's the laundry soap? The what? Laundry soap. Laundry soap? It's over there on 16. Thanks, bro. Appreciate that. And where are my constitutional rights? Oh, they're not here. Where else? Oh, there we go. Nice. He's so hard to outsmart. Jesus fucking Christ. Oh my God, man. You just tell them I'm a shit talker? You just swear at employees that you're supposed to be protecting? Fucking idiot. This man's been harassing me. Who's, who's up? This man's been harassing me for the past, what, Did 10 minutes? I mean, phone number. Uh, civilians were always nice to me. It's the. She's now making fun of my disability, this piece of shit. See that? Working on.
Unbelievable. Is it your fucking business? Thank you, ma'am. You have a great day. You also. Appreciate it. Bye bye. Excuse me? Oh, yeah, I don't want to forget that. Yeah, well, appreciate that. Do you bootleg for them too? I used to work for them. They, they don't they appreciate They fired that. you? Oh. Poor guy. Now he's got to follow me around. That's how it goes. Yeah, fixing it, it'll work. That's what I use. See? Are we done? These are Tetris. Are we done? Am I done? Yeah. You said I'm done? I said, are we done? Yes, we're done. Are you done? Go do him. What? He's deaf and dumb. You don't remember who I was? Remember we went to school together? You used to pick on me? I would appreciate it if you'd leave me the fuck alone now. How about no? Until you get off my property, I'll leave you alone. Don't you think you've pretty much given me reason? To do what? I don't know. My face is right here. Yeah, I'm waiting for it so I can. I know. We can have a. So you can what? So I can snap on your check. You know what I mean? You got it. I appreciate your business, sir. Thank you for having a dead phone. Okay. They pick on you on the street. I save your life. Snap. Please snap. Hurry up. Snap. Every day. 20 years. And this dumb piece of state thinks he can break me. I would never break you. Yeah. You're a good guy. We went to school together. Mm -hmm. Here we go again. You don't want to go to school with me? There it is. The swallow of fear. That's all I needed. That's all I needed. Fuck. But of course he's not done. Of course, of course he isn't. He work for you? Huh? He work for you? No. What happened? I don't know. He's been following me around for the past uh, 20 minutes. Is that what it was? Making fun of my disability. See, I'm disabled and he's making fun of that. Mr. Allied Universal. No real fucking name because he's not even a person. You know, that guy. This is unfucking real. I mean, it's unfucking real how hard it was not to fucking hit him, bro. Oh my god. It was legitimately difficult. So you're not the same security company as him? No. You you work for Sprouts, mm -hmm. and he works for the. So you're a different company completely. Mm -hmm. You know why he would have followed me around like that? Mm -hmm. He's been following you around. Mm -hmm. You know why he would have followed me around like that? Mm -hmm. He's been following you around for a couple of how many hours? Since I got here. Are you serious? <laughs> So, will he be waiting for me? Or did he finally fucking leave? Hey, look, he left. So, this Starbucks, the same place where my Wi-Fi was turned off for 
two weeks in uh, 2016, right after I tried to shut down the federal building with 2,000 ladybugs. Oops. Yeah, this is how much cream I just paid $3.15 for. So when did they change the policy? Uh, all the uh, issues at Starbucks has been handled. But when did they change the policy? Man, since during the pandemic. Because I've all, I've, no one's ever refused to give me heavy cream before. So I'll pay for it. Yeah, I have no way to charge you. It's a 50 cent charge. I've seen it be charged. You can charge 50 cents for cream. Can someone explain to this guy who's worked for Starbucks since 2008 that he can charge me for cream, 50 cents? This is weird. Yes, and I'm, I'm paying for the cream. I'm trying to pay for the cream, sir. Can I pay for the cream? You could, you could buy a short cup of cream for regular price. Cream, a upcharge of cream is 50 cents. Yeah, you didn't buy anything, so I can't do that. I'm not gonna argue with you about it. That's a policy and that's the way it is. That's whose policy? That's Starbucks policy. Starbucks official policy. It's not something you're doing to me right now in the no. store. Uh -uh. Sorry. Can you ring me up for the cream? Please? I mean, I only need about a third of a cup. A third of a short cup. Everything else I'm just gonna pour out. It's up to you. On your counter. I don't want cold milk. I want a 50 cents of cream, please. Yeah, I know, and I'm not charging you for the cream either. I'm just charging you for cold. But it's a 50 cent cost for cream, sir. I'm not going to argue with you about this. I cannot do that. You can, okay. though. No one's ever refused it before. It's weird. Sorry. Go go to another Starbucks if you think you can get it. I've always it got it. You can't. Starting when, though? I told you, during the pandemic. Really? In, ca in which case, everyone who's given it to me at this store has been breaking the rules? Probably. Wow. Yeah. Sure you're not? I mean, it, cream's free. No. It is, Unless you buy something. But I'm trying to buy the cream. Yeah, I know. You're not getting it for 50 cents. So but I only want 50 cents worth of cream. I'm not going to argue with you. It's done You deal. keep saying that, and but you're breaking Starbucks policy. No, no. Yeah, you are, though. I'll pay for the whole thing if that's what it's going to take. Weird. I'll pay for the whole thing. I'm just telling you how it's going to go down. For 50 cents worth of cream. Keep it. Hmm? You can keep it. Okay. Thank you. It'll come up down there. Anything over a third is going to get poured out in the counter. Just, just so you know. Do you only want half? Uh, about a third of the cup. And then six butters, please. Six butters. Yes. Well, thanks for all the free coffee, Mark. I appreciate that. Well, if you can see, the last transaction was me getting charged $3.15 for a third of a short cup of heavy cream, which by Starbucks policy is free. But for some reason, because I'm homeless, the employee, Mark, refused to give me the free 
He said it's a new Starbucks policy, but he was obviously lying because cream, you can't, you don't charge for cream. And if you do, it's a 50 cent upcharge, which I tried to pay. He, I was willing, so, hold on, hold on. Here comes sirens, you won't hear me. Oh, Mark, I just got off with customer service. He just gave me $15. You could have just given me the cream, bro. Oh, he drives, uh, look what he drives. Look what he drives. Broke company's policy, son. Were they, were you told to, or you just do it on your own? I mean, it's a little weird it happened today. Who told you to do that, bro? Who told you to violate company policy? Anyone? I mean, were you, were you instructed to be an asshole to me, or how'd I'm it go? Away from my car. Huh? I'm in the next spot, bro. Who told you to do that to me, bro? I mean, why, why would you give me $15 in free coffee by violating company policy? Weird. And now, it's that guy, but that's not the main event. It's this guy. Go look on the cop's face. The cop absolutely knows that's an undercover cop and this is a performance? I guess. The fact that it happened with them running by me, her screaming, didn't get the camera on in time. And I, look how nonchalant the cop is. Oh, oh let, me, let me help you here, pal. Did you see how nonchalant the cop was, dude? Started shaking. I had to take a hand off and turn around, and make sure my bags. This is where I'm sitting, and this is where that's happening. This little farce. It's a farce. Obviously a farce. Uh, oh, good. You're nasty screaming again. Uh, they're cops. This is an act. And then, it's like a dance. They, I wonder if they rehearse. You guys rehearse? You're just winging it. You guys winging it? No, I don't know. A little dance step right there. Do 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 do. You know, professional wrestling is choreographed. So is uniform cops arresting undercover cops. It's choreographed. Clearly. Literally, this is happening not just near me, right? Right. Literally sitting where I'm sitting, I have to look at it. Thanks. Thanks, guys. The Oscar's in the mail, bro. And just a heads up, I just got $15 in free coffee because Mark wouldn't give me free cream. So, just cost the company money when you break company policy. Okay. Well, and I just get a large straw. Mm -hmm. So I stop over here for a second in the shade and then literally 30 seconds after I pull up. This is the day. Small world, bro. Anyway, you ever hear of Ciara Estrada? What's that? Ciara Estrada. She wore that badge and was killed by her boyfriend who was also wearing that badge in 2016. You ever hear of her? Okay, I haven't, no, no. You should, she's got eight million views on YouTube. She was the nicest cop. Okay. Shot in the head by a cop. Well, I'm sorry to hear that. that. That's why they don't tell you about it. Because if she died in the line of duty, you'd be wearing her name on your on your side, right? 
Yeah, I, I don't, I don't know. I'm not familiar with it. That's, that's I'm awesome. just, I'm just, I'm just talking to as many cops as possible and just showing that nobody remembered. Probably one of the nicest, best cops that ever wore that particular uniform, and she was killed by a cop. You should look her up, Ciara Estrada. Never forget. And how do you know that's an undercover cop just laying in the median after they work shifts of being flamboyant and ridiculous when I'm panhandling right here. But here's how you know that's an undercover cop. These cops are just going to drive the fuck by him like nothing's there. Watch this. Watch what happens here. Uh, let's see. Cop just going to drive by. The guy just literally laying in a median. Do, 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 do. Nope, no problem. This guy laying down in the median. Just go, go about your business, sir. That's how you know it's a cop. Because in any other situation, if they didn't know that was an undercover cop laying there, they would, of course, stop. I mean, are you kidding me? At least turn on the radio and, hey, man, you okay? Get up. Nope. Nothing. Just going to leave them laying there in the median of one of the busiest intersections in town. Which just happens to be, you know, where I'm trying to make a living. I just want to point out that right next to where I panhandle, they now have stashed a bag that looks just like mine. And ostensibly, it was just because yesterday, as I was leaving, the guy whose bag it is kept coming after me. Hey, man, you got my bag. No, I don't, Narc. You know I don't. That's your bag. But it's kind of creepy that they're just using a replica of my bag. It just, I mean, that's scary, man. I have nothing against in and out That turns out to be something, man. That was Team B, bro. That's my bag. It's the Snitch Patrol. The Snitch Patrol. When I arrived in this part of town, they were over a total different area where I arrived. Now they're walking by me as I'm waiting for the bus. With knowledge. How many think you're going to turn into snitches? <laughs> Hopefully none. none of them. Hopefully none? What kind of cop are you? <laughs> the Snitch Patrol. Snitch Patrol. Appreciate your business, sir. Thank you for having a dead phone. Okay. <laughs> <laughs>